eventful game for you? Some good plays, bad plays? Is that just you have to stick with it? Yeah, I think, yeah, obviously, and I think it started with an unfortunate bounce there. Uh, he was going to receive the pass. I thought I had full control of the situation. He just bounced up and off we go. And I fell. I, I don't know how I fell. I didn't have a, anything on my skate either. So that, that stuff's going to happen. But I feel pretty good about my game today. And I uh, feel pretty good about my game uh, for a while now. So I'm just going to stick with the positive, obviously, and uh, uh, keep rolling here. Is it important to step up in times like that? I mean, I think as a team, you guys played a lot better down the stretch when you were trying to get that tying goal. I think we uh, we have a really good system six and five, and uh, we stuck with it. And uh, I think we uh, we hold on to the pucks there and take what's open. We uh, we knew what they were gonna try to pack it in. Uh, we, they play five and six, and we got some some opportunities there. And credit to the guys down low, they won back the pucks, and that's how you create scoring chances. Were you just looking? Were you shooting for a tip? Or you were you on that on that goal in the last minute there? No, I'm just trying to get it through the first guy, and uh, I saw he was in the lane almost all the time when me and Miro had a puck up top, and uh, I was just trying to fake him out and, and get it through. And luckily, it went went all the way in. But I think yeah, there was a lot of screens in front. So, like I said, uh, that's what you need. That puck is never gonna go in if someone is screening the goal. I mean, did these two games against Boston and St. Louis, two of the best teams in the league. Yeah, I think uh, uh, it's a good measure point. We're we're absolutely up there. We can battle with these guys, uh, and you know, you can really tell that these are two uh, veteran teams. They they know how to play the game, and uh, that's what we're gonna learn from here. But obviously, on the road, uh, being behind and then coming back in games, I think it's huge for us, and we know that we can do that. We've been doing that all season, so. It's been a good measure point. I really feel like we can play with those guys. What, what's the next step for you guys to beating those kinds of teams? I think it's controlling the momentum in the game. Uh, we feel like we can play with them, but we're going to have to play with them 60 minutes. And uh, I mean, if you just control the breakdowns, you know that there's going to be breakdowns in a 60-minute game. And if you can, can control that and stick with your uh, team game uh, within the system, you're going to be successful.